Hey guys, just a little update. The 80, I'm getting it put together. Uh, I did get a, I had a couple sets of these hydraulic brakes. This one, it did not have any fluid in it. Because I just opened it up on the package and stuck it on there. And yeah, I didn't have any fluid in it. Uh, I had to mess with it quite a little bit and finally got it to work. But... Uh, you know Chinese products sometimes but uh, the scrap 80 is finally starting to come back to life um, we'll be pulling the Tilly off of that because I've got a 224 getting ready to go on it um, I'm literally just throwing this bike together out of parts I have laying around I've got to pull some more pieces off of this frame to uh, finish it up of course this frames broke so it uh, it was road hard um, the storm 200 I've got just over 100 miles on it now uh, adjusted the brakes did a chain adjustment on it motors broke in the two-ply tires on it I was kind of scared about, but, I mean, they are really holding up actually quite well. I can't really complain. Uh, the DB30 Dirt Bug, she got brand spanking new wheel bearings put in it. Um, it's got a brand new brake on it. Uh, runs like a top, so I really can't complain about it on anything. Uh, the Bird... Uh, I've got it tore down right now because I'm getting ready to do a bunch of work to it. And I've got a Doodlebug 30S that I've got to order some more. Oh, I can't remember what all I need for it. I think I need I need a neck bearings and a few other things for it. Um, it's I, I bought a just a frame. It's not even a roller. It's just the frame and forks. I'm going to have to come up with a seat for it and everything else. It's pretty rough, but I'll get to working on it. I've got that uh, Wildcat 223 that's going to go on it, so it should be quite an interesting bike. The 80, we are piecing it together. We'll be using that 75 tooth clutch off, or the 75 tooth rear sprocket at 12 tooth clutch. It's going to be like a 6.2 gear ratio, so... I may go ahead and just order a new 420 clutch for it, 420 chain, and go ahead and at least drop down to like a 60 with a 12, so I at least have a nice five average gear at or ratio on that thing. Because, I don't know, 6.1, 6.2, that thing's probably going to stand straight up in the air and beat you to death. But we're going to just piece it together and send it, but... That's where I'm at, guys. I uh, will try Sunday to uh, give you guys an in-depth review on this, on everything that I've had to do to it and this and that, and then probably give you a point-of-view ride. So I'll catch you all later. Have a good one.